<laughs> Whiskers? I think he does this for the camera because he literally never does this. Okay, now that we're settled. So I'm actually really, really excited for this video because it's October and Halloween is around the corner and I don't know what I'm gonna be for Halloween. And frankly, does it even matter? Like this video is not about me. Screw me. Because this video is going to be about this cutie right here him he doesn't really know that halloween is coming because um he doesn't really speak english or spanish he barely even speaks at this point my dog is a senior so um just because you're a senior doesn't mean that you can't go out trick-or-treating and i feel like my dog needs the bombest most swaggiest coolest costume on the block now, last year, he was a teddy bear. Um, the year before that, he was... I don't even remember. And I don't think I have pictures of that. I just have the picture of the teddy bear. Um, but I have another dog. His name's Coco. He was a cowboy last year. I'll put a picture. Both kind of the same size. Coco doesn't live here in my house. He lives in my farm. But yeah, for today's video, I'm going to go on the hunt for the best doggy costume for my son whiskers i feel like i should just buy a lot and have him try it on and do a little bit of a doggy costume try on haul because why not i have plenty of time on my hands and this seems like the best way i want to waste my time oh yeah i'm probably gonna go to target because i love target and Again, I have plenty of time on my hands, and I can't think of any better way to, to waste it than at Target. You know what I mean? So, yeah. I'm gonna head over there. Alright, so, I'm on my way to Target. I'm with my cousin, and we are gonna check out some doggy costumes. And she's actually gonna check out some baby costumes, too, because the baby's in the back. Where is she? Oh, she's I facing the other the way. She does not want to be a unicorn. I think I scared her. So I'm back. I think he knows what's up. I got him a few costumes. And as I mentioned, I have another small dog. He's not here. His name is Coco. So some of these outfits will be for Coco. But I'm not going to show you what he looks like in these costumes because... <sighs> or maybe I will. I don't know. Probably not. But let's try this on. The first one I got is the school bus. Why did I get the school bus? Because it looked cute. You are the cutest little school bus. Yes. Are you a cute school bus?
So this kind of just looks like a vest, to be honest. I don't think I like this one very much. The banana hat. Tell me the banana hat isn't cute. I could put this one on right now. So, whiskers. Are you ready? How does a banana... Oh, it's, it goes like this. Are you guys ready? He hates it. The next one I got is the German pretzel. I love pretzels, so I think I'm going to love my dog in a pretzel costume. Also, look at the dog. It's a big dog. What size did I get? I got medium. I think he's a medium. So... <laughs> the next one I got is Olaf because I just thought it was funny. Where's the picture? There was a picture, it's probably somewhere here, but it's like like him walking would just be adorable. Don't you think, Whiskers? Yeah, you're gonna be Olaf. Whiskers. Sit. Wow, who's that? Who's that? Who's that handsome boy? Okay, bring me the toy. Whiskers, bring me the toy. Whiskers, come. Whiskers, come. Whiskers. All right, so that's the end of the Halloween dog costume try-on haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to follow me on Instagram if you want to see his pictures. I post them on there too. Um, he definitely looks really cute as an Olaf. I think this is my favorite costume. This one or the, or the German pretzel. Anyways, bye.